Honey Buns. Welcome to my channel. I am Mama Eve. It is a good day, a wonderful day, a fantastic day. But most of all, if this is your day, I'm glad you tuned in uh, for, for this wonderful session, this wonderful video. It's a full moon community reading. Full moon community reading. That's quite a tongue twister. So I just want to shuffle the cards and let's see what's going on. All right. All right, dears. So what I see here as it is time for some of you to move on. Time to move on. You, you're living in the past. You're scared to take that launch out in the deep. Uh, just whether it's business or your personal life, it is time to move on. Forget about some of the things that's holding you back. Uh, there's a saying that in order to go forward, you have to get rid of some of the things that is holding you back. So this will be a wonderful time, a wonderful season for you to, to get rid of those things that's holding you back. Listen, if something's not benefiting you, if something is not benefiting you, why do we we so often want to hold on to things because we are afraid of change. Do not do not be afraid of change. Know that you, it's okay to, to launch out. It's okay to let go. Oh, it, and it's time. Also, I see here that there may be some money that would need to be spent as far as expenses. This could be home repairs. This could be car repairs. So it's going to be a time or a season where we're balancing our money. We're balancing our money. And uh, we're going to be okay. We're going to get through this. We have so much stuff going on. I know money is tight for a lot of folks. But guess what? We are rich. We are rich. So keep that. Keep trying to manifest that. Keep believing that. That all of your needs are going to be met. All your needs are going to be met. Because I believe all the needs. Now I'm not talking about wants. Needs are going to be met. Okay. This is a great time to start working on a new business. Start working on a new business you are pregnant with possibilities however the only thing that's hindering you is you the only thing that's hindering you is you start planning start writing you've been dreaming and dreaming and hoping and praying and believing but yet things have been stagnated because you have to put that uh, uh initiative up you you need to, to just get yourself together and start writing things out and start moving towards your goals and your dreams. Don't worry. I don't have money to do this. I don't have money to do that. Um, as far as your visions goes, there is a saying that if you have the vision, God will always make the provision for the vision and so this is a wonderful time to work on your business to do some new things um and and just take it one day at a time but start moving toward it now stop letting people stress you out giving you a headache uh causing anxiety people are going to be people period simple that's it but you do not have to give in to foolishness you don't have to give in to foolishness uh know 
where you stand. Don't budge on what you believe. And you're going to be perfectly okay. Um, if I'm going to have a headache, it's because I have a headache. You're not going to give me a headache. You're not going to stress me out to the point where I'm halfway crazy. And I see here in these cards that that's what's going on. Some of you are so depressed and sad and anxious about things or people. You cannot change people. Change yourself. Change the situation and you're going to feel better. Okay. All right. So what I see here is it really goes with the line that I just read. And what it's telling me is there is just a spirit of I don't want to deal with things. I just need to escape. Well, well, my honey buns, sometimes we got to face situations head on. Head on. That's the only way that they're going to be resolved. So this is a time to resolve some things. Resolve some issues. Resolve some situations. The longer you do, don't address it, the worse it's going to become. So this is, a, this is quite a time. This is going to be a great uh, time for some issues to be resolved. Okay. For all those that's married or in a relationship, whether you have a husband, wife, a partner, um, girlfriend, boyfriend, um, I see here that I need to say, honesty is always the best policy. Be honest. Be honest. If you're not honest, what I see here is some deception. So it's going to be exposed. Uh-oh. Some deceptions will be exposed. So honesty truly is the best policy. This is a great time for some decision making. Some great time for decision making. Um, there is some things that you've been putting off. Some hard decisions that you didn't want to tackle. But as I see here with the hermit, Your path is going to be clear. All right? So what I would suggest is to pray for clear thinking. Don't just make decisions and on the spur of the moment. Take your time. Think things over. And once you think things over, move on that action. Whether it's positive or you need some changes in your life, don't speak without really thinking about what it is you want to say. You know, and, and please, my honey buns, try not to say too many things on a negative if you are angry with somebody. Because a lot of times what happens is you speak from your mouth, but not your heart. And sometimes that's hard to recuperate from. So before you think, think soberly. Think with just uh, pure thoughts. Um, 
a calming spirit. I always tell my honey buns that's close to me and my godchildren, never do workings when you're angry. Because if you do workings when you're angry, then you may later on regret it. Don't speak if you're angry. Take a moment, calm down, cool down, get yourself together, and then make your decisions or speak. All right. All right. Now, what I see here is a situation that uh, victory is right around the corner. Oh, my goodness. Victory is right around the corner. Uh, there's going to be light at the end of the tunnel. There is going to be sun that come out after a period of rain. I'm talking about rain in your life. I'm talking about one thing happening after another, after another. What I would have to say to you is victory is so close to you. I see it, I feel it, and I declare and decree that happiness and joy will return back in your life. And I know that it's been a struggle because I see here that you've been struggling with some things and just faced with so many horrible things. But lift up your head. Lift up your spirit. Because happiness, joy, peace is so close. All you have to do is reach out and touch it and receive it. I hope that you enjoy this full moon reading or consultation or session. I enjoyed it so much and I pray that I helped somebody. After all, this was a good day. This was a great day. This was a fantastic day, but what's more important, this, my honey buns, was your day. Subscribe, give me some thumbs up, ring the bell, and check my next video out. You have a good day, a good evening, or a good night. Kisses.